That is like, ugh. No, this game is not like Firewatch, even if we're in a watchtower, okay. extra food, fuel. I wonder how much fuel is in these things. It's like it has endless amounts. You know it would be really helpful if he were to give me that shotgun back. That's it. Man, what is this tank? I drove like 300 feet and used a quarter of my fuel. Is it leaking? the ambush camp. Uh oh. Hey. They're coming. Hey. I did. I'm going to kill you, too. Fuck your head up. Whoops. Some durable motherfuckers. God. What the hell? They're taking shots like it's nothing. Don't open fire, ma'am. No, let's try lowering it even lower. It's just too high. Taking so many hits to the face like it's nothing. Oh my god, did you fucking die? God, stop moving. Move back. 
Yeah, everyone's like a super damage sponge on hard, which I hate when developers do that. Find more ammo. not like the aiming in this game at all. Open fire! Like this gun feels worthless. Its aim is so bad, it's supposed to be a rifle. A second, sir. Hey, okay, ladies, so much more effective. Thank you. It takes three gunshots and only two crossbows. I don't understand it. It does not make any sense to me. That's the last of them. Jesus, God. how many men have you pissed off? Okay, well, we got them all, though. The crossbow does so much more damage than the gun. I don't... It doesn't make any sense, but okay. Let's swap this out. I think automatic would help out a bunch more. Which is fine by me, because crossbow is right. much easier to make. This has got to be the generator, but it's been shot to hell. I bet I could fix it, though. What weapon do you have? Nope. Don't want that one. Oh, there's fuel if I need it. All right, rifle ammo, good, good, good. Okay. Hopefully, I can find more of that. Six is not a m very much ammo. I have to replace my melee weapon, it's almost gone. Okay, if I do that, it's gonna trigger something, probably. Check out the environment first. Wow, that is dark in there. Okay. Holy damn. It was like a, someone cast a darkness spell. that 
scrap. Do that for bandages. All right, let's pray the joiner and see what happens. Okay, that should do it. There we go. Drop it! Whoa! If you had bullets, I wouldn't be breathing, now would I? Please, mister. I don't shoot women if I have a choice. Do I have a choice? I ain't got nothing. I got nowhere to go. You should have shot her. You're going to regret Jesus it later, I bet you. All right. Let's see if they got an underground bunker around here. Uh, uh, underground bunker? Those and that. Oh, I saw the door inside over there. That's what that was. Yeah, now we can open it. Grab all this scrap. Can I get on the roof? Why, yes, I can. Nothing up here, though, looks like. Cop car. Ammo. Go for the ammo. So far, they always have ammo in the back, these cop cars. Yeah, 14 ammo, not bad. Another rag. Oh, there's a... Machete, I'll take that. That was a very powerful weapon compared to the baseball bat. Wait a minute, you can go up this tower, can't you? Whoa. Let's Ubisoft this. Maybe I'll sink and I'll be able to see the whole area. Uh, so far, this game's pretty fun. I'm enjoying it. I think we're still in tutorial mode to learn how to play, but we haven't quite gotten open open world yet. But it's been pretty fun. I'm enjoying it. Okay, not much up here. Approach a ladder to automatically climb down it. That scares me, though. Now, did she actually drop a gun? A re 22 repeater. Less rate of fire, but more damage. Mm. But down to five. No, I think I'll stick with this one. The automatic is just a little better, I think. Yeah, here it is. That is one strong knife. Are you kidding me? Damn. To not snap lifting that heavy ass thing. Something tells me that there's someone's around here still. Yeah, be careful. Is 
Baseball bat, scrap. Hey, this is handy. A map. All marked up. Yeah, nice. No starving patriots. Unlocked ambush camp hunter. Craft recipe spiked bat. Guess they won't be needing it. <laughs> Not anymore. Newly discovered craft recipes are shown in the survival wheel. Deke, you there? It's probably nothing. It sounded like bike engines. Riding somewhere on the mountain. I just finished clearing Boxing the radio tower nails. for Copeland. I'm, I'm gonna climb the tower, see if I can see anything. Oh, there's crafting of weapons, too? That that might ha be better now. Let's see. Oh, yeah, the crafted weapon's way better than the uh, just pick up weapon. That's, that's kind of cool. Wait. You want me to cut? I was just up there. I could tell you. <laughs> Let's do it again. Go back to where you just were. Play Dr. Fantipo. Thank you for those hey, subs, Deke. guys. You okay? You don't sound Glad like over the five year like yourself. Result. It's not, it's nothing. You know, I just let this drifter get the drop on me. Lucky for me, she was uh, out of ammo. You let her go, didn't you? Okay. Yeah, fuck. Yes, yes, I let her go. Stays deep. That code of yours, it's gonna get you killed. Yeah, well, something's gonna do it, right? Does it matter what? Deacon out. Jesus, what a climb. Alright, let's see what the hell Boozer's talking about. That is beautiful. We're right. Someone's on the mountain. I see smoke from their campfire. Son of a bitch. I knew I heard something. Where are they? I'm gonna head out there. Oh my god, these no, mountains are god beautiful. It, Boozer, gotta get your arm healed up so we can ride the hell out of here. I'll take care of him. Oh, shit. That is beautiful. Just, I'm going a little stir crazy here, Dick. Just try to stay awake in case they head your way. Deacon out. Oh, Jesus. I gotta get in shape. Thank you, Luffy King, for that resale. Deacon out. Dan B. Almost there. Yeah, come on, keep going. Almost there. Oh, shit's killing me. Well, that ladder's easier to climb in her stones. Sounds like engines. Keep my brother alive. Hmm. All right, now we have a skill point. Let's see. Provides chance to retrieve some bolts you've been fired from your crossbow. Plants are displayed on the mini map. Increase the time, the icons uh, display for survival vision. Those are useful. Ability to follow a melee attack with a range attack for massive damage. Oh. Move and aim range weapon with more precision. There we go. Act ability to activate focus while aiming a range shot. What does that mean? And then melee. Kill small enemies after successfully escaping from with grapple. Ability to repair melee weapons with scrap. It improves the initial recovery and duration of a stamina cocktail. Increased damage of both crafted and found melee weapons. Generate salmon for every melee kill. But for longer combos with melee weapons. 
Hmm. So I guess it's like, which one do I want to focus on? I'm going to go with this focus shot. While aiming, press time will slow down momentarily to make more accurate shots. Focus duration will increase skill upgrades and your injectors from your points. Move and aim a range weapon with more precision. Yeah, we'll do that one. Hold L2 and tap R2 while moving with settings that particularly easier and reduce the uh, spread while aiming with L2. What? Hold and tap while moving. What now? When in focus, what ranged weapons will have increased power to stop weaker enemies. Reduces cooldown of focus. Improves the initial recovery and duration of focus cocktail. This game alright so far? I'm enjoying it. Having fun. It's not like blowing me away or anything. But I'm having fun with it so far. Sterilizer. Yeah. Wonder how quickly you level in this. Buffer. Done. Oh, there's some ammo here. Good. Saw off shotgun. Hmm. Now that just might be more my style. Oh, it only has three shots. Wish you could have more than one weapon at a time. Primary weapon at a time. Is that a skill to have more than one weapon? <laughs> Simply increases crossbolt damage. Range weapon accuracy, load times. No longer seem focused when reloading a ranged weapon. Increase ammo capacity for all ranged weapons. Headshot kills recover health. Yeah, we'll stick with the AK for now. Though I would love to have a shotgun backup, but it's fine. Especially for zombies up close. Kill us some freakers. Let's ride out, chat. Give us some Dan Kona. Let's ride, brothers. St. John to Copeland's camp. It's done. The radio tower's locked down. I've restored your radio lovely. Copy that. You may not see the value in St. John, but Radio Free Oregon is the only thing keeping us from turning into savages. <laughs> no cope, the only thing keeping us from turning into savages is about nine square meals. Try going hungry for three days. There's no such thing as a starving patriot. Well, sir, I hope to God you're right about that. Don't do that. Radio Free Oregon. Jesus, oh, oh God. Booze man, you awake? I'm uh, heading to that camp you spotted north of the mountain. Uh, I heard gunshots. It might be an ambush camp. Oh no. Sometimes the best strategy is to run away. If you have stamina available, press to sprint. 
Find out when I get there. Eek it out! Who's man? You were right. They set up along the railroad tracks. Kill every one of the sons of bitches. Yeah. That was kind of the plan. Eek it out. Hey! Nope, don't run at me. So, uh, what, what were you saying? Deke, you got your radio on? Got some time on my hands. Made you some shit. Hey! Yeah, that asshole sneaking up on me. Who's man? Thank you. Yeah, with the run up. Run! Seems like this gun has really bad aim fall off. Tripwire. Okay, I'm moving up. Shit. Oh, did you like that? Stay down off of Leary Mountain. I was like, eat my back. Right in the face. I gotta watch out for these trip mines are everywhere. Uh-oh. Loser, it's done. Squatter camp. They won't be doing any more killing on O'Leary Mountain. Good. Deke. I should have been there. To help, I mean, I... Shit. Just rest up, booze man. Rest up. We're riding north as soon as your arm heals. You got that? Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Booze are up. Oh, she's in a trap. Yeah, she's in a trap. I'm gonna ride up to the cemetery <laughs> and see if I can find that stash. Sorry. What was that? Rest up, loser. We're, We're heading north trap. as soon as you can ride. North. Yeah. Salt rifle ammo. Good. Up. Did you say you were heading north? Booze man, no. You know I wouldn't ride north without you. Yeah, yeah, I know. I just kind of out of it. Well, third degree burns will do that to you. <laughs> yeah. So, take care, Alvarez, you know. Deke, it means a lot to me. Take care of her, Boozer. Just get some rest. Deacon out. She's dead, buddy. What are you? There's something wrong with that guy. But that is not a fire axe. That is this a is shotgun symbol. What the? The truth <laughs> shall set you free. Who remembers the skid rows of this great country? People living on the streets in boxes and tents.
because they couldn't afford the American dream. Some of those good people fought for this very country. Only to have the feds forget about them as soon as they were done with them. PTSD? Doesn't stand for post-traumatic stress disorder. It stands for put them soldiers down. Oh! Well, we're all homeless now. Living in the wilderness in the way of our forebearers. The feds used to think we needed their welfare and handouts to survive. We showed them how wrong they were. What we need now is a strong will, determination, and trust in each other. The feds were never gonna give us that. And you, you want our trust? You gotta learn it. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. That's great. That's great. Radio Free Oregon is on the air once again. Oh, Jesus, what have I done? God. Oh, God! Ow! God damn it! Ow! God damn it! Ow! Ow! Well, that's one way to disarm a bear trap. Well, if you step in a bear trap, you lose your leg. Teak. Oh God! I'm sick and tired. Down you go. Oh God! <laughs> Damn wolf! Son of a bitch! I got a use for you. What happens when you die? Nothing? Okay. All right, looks like you just respawn. Okay. I heard a cougar. Okay, hopefully they have some bullets on them. Deke. Oh, God damn it. What's up, bro? I'm sick and tired of drifters coming in my camp, killing folk like we were out in the shit. What's going on, Cope? A man come in, drugged out of his mind, shot the place up, then he just took off. Then he said his bike's got a red tank on it. And he was wearing some kind of motocross helmet, silver. Okay, if I go now, I might be able to catch up to him. I want him alive, Deke. Alive? Alive. You catch this man, then radio me. We'll fetch him and hang the bastard right from that limb. It's time we start showing these drifter sons of bitches that we have law and order in this camp. No offense meant to yourself. I'm taken. I'll find him. Drugged out of his mind. We are close. Chasing Leon. Well. Kind of close to that one. Although, as you know, it's about the same distance. God, get out of there. Mass grave. I keep forgetting. Uh oh. So to uh oh. Don't ask me how. New trials game looks sick. <laughs> what if they will do a trials but with zombies? What if that would work? That'd be a tricky one. Oh my god, I feel like there's a horde behind me.
hoping they give up the chase. I'm gonna be in real big back. trouble. This man, I track it down. We kill. Why do you care? It's just another bounty job, isn't it? Now look, I don't care. I just want to know their names. Who, Cope? One of them is a man named Randall. Been with the camp almost a year. I didn't know the other two. You want me to ask? No, I guess not. You find that son of a bitch, you radio me. Copeland out. Um, okay, let's take a look around. God, can't go there. What am I looking for? Something in this blue area. Nope. Wrong direction. Grab that plant real fast. I, what am I looking for in this area? Inside this blue circle, I always need scrap. I see blood. I see bullets. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Gotcha. There he is! Biker bounty. Some bounty targets will stand and fight. Others will flee. Chase her down and capture them alive with the job. Daring their into and shooting their bike are your best options. You need to keep your target alive. Silver helmet. Uh oh, gas uh -oh, uh -oh. That's him. Oh, shit. <laughs> the hell? So you thought you'd ride into Copeland's camp and shoot the place. Uh, you can't boost that equipment right. Nitros, purchase an upgrade. Well, shit. So, that about right. Kill a few folks, take some shit, and just ride out, and you just go and shop it. How do you... Can you shoot on the bike? Let him get away, Deke. Uh, walk to, to acquire the target and tap to fire your sidearm. Okay. Go to hell, Drifter! Copeland can suck on it, you hear me? You can't get away from me! Copeland sent you! Tell him to go to hell! Almost down. Okay, this does feel really stupid, this part. This, all these mechanics in this right now feel really bad. I just leave him there? Okay, I guess they'll pick him up on his own. I, I guess. I, don't. I need to take him to the river and wash his mouth out, though. He's got a potty mouth on him, doesn't he? Damn. Cope, it's done. I got him. You Marked down these coordinates. Twenty-eight and you, fuel. Uh -oh. You hear me? Is he alive? Hey, hey, drifter. Drift, drifter. Yeah, he's alive. But I won't promise you how long he's gonna stay that way. Deacon out. 
You tell him, Drifter. You tell him I said to go. Goes to go, so. Hey, Deke, you there? Oh, I can't I'm run over. about heading down to that logging camp. Clear out those nests. I've been seeing more freaks up here. Who's your... No. No. I'm gonna need some fuel. Uh, you gotta wait till you're whole, brother. There's an invisible wall around him, so I can't throw uh, him over him. Damn. Here. Anyway, so... I gotta find me some fuel badly. Tonight, if you were freaks inside those nests, or take them out while it's still light out, be more than you to be strong. St. John, Scotland. I haven't seen Boozer in a few days. He used to do runs for me, is all. I know you ride with him. Tried to radio him, can't seem to reach him. Oh, there's when you some see fuel. him, okay. tell him to swing by go. and say hello to Cope. I would much appreciate it. Cope and out. <sighs> Look, there's just fuel canisters everywhere here. All right, I gotta grab my food, guys. We'll be right back in just a second. This is Radio Free Oregon. Yeah, be the truth shall set you free. We'll be right back in a second. Ah, I'm back, guys. Bree, who remembers the skid rows of this great country? People living on the streets in boxes and tents because they couldn't afford the American dream. Some of those good people fought for this very country, only to have the feds forget about them. As soon as they were done with them. PTSD doesn't stand for post traumatic stress disorder. It stands for put them soldiers down. Well, we're all homeless now. Not only that's true. Living in the wilderness in the way of our forebears. 
feds used to think we needed their welfare and handouts to survive. We showed them how wrong they were. What we need now is a strong will, determination, and trust in each other. The feds were never going to give us that. Trust? You gotta earn it. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. That's stay out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> I love running them over. Something very peaceful about riding around the countryside on a motorcycle. Feeling America's tears hit your face. Knowing I'm free. It's beautiful. Thanks for those resubs, MWT and Bad Gamer. Thank you guys. Yeah, a lot of the di dialogues at first were really good, but they've been kind of tapering off ever since the beginning intro mission. So I feel less invested now. I don't know. Someone's approaching the gate. Open the door. One of the biker boys. Open up. How's it going, Thief? Going good, bruh. 